Hello everyone, this is Sharmin Khan from Milky Way Art Design. Welcome to my channel. Today's video is an experimental video. I will layer my colors in different orders every time and we will see how the outcome changes. So let's get going. Let me introduce you to the colors first. So today I have, this is ore from TLP. Beautiful gold. This is nickel azo gold from golden this one is uh let me show you the two colors i mixed triad titanium white and cobalt teal and i have this beautiful blue color this one is van dyke brown from amsterdam and i have these three cell activators one is carbon black from amsterdam this one is deep gold from Amsterdam and this one is also titanium white from Amsterdam. So I was not successful last time making any cells with them. So this time I'm going to try it again. So these three are my cell activators and these are my three colors. On the first try I am layering my pale blue first and then on top of that I have the Van Dyke brown and then comes the ore from TLP and after that I will have my uh, nickel azo gold and then I will have all my cell activators For the cell activators, I started with carbon black, then I layered my white, titanium white, and after that, I used the deep gold. By the way, if you are with me today watching the entire video, please tell me which one is your most favorite because I love to hear from you guys. And trust me, I read each and every one of the comments that you make it's a joy for me So far it's looking good. I'm really digging in. I'm going to start spinning and as I do that I'm going to stop periodically and use a skewer head to test how much paint has been left uh, after the spinning uh, on the surface especially on the midsection because if we have too much paint left there is going to be crack or crease or it will not dry nicely making sure that all my sides are nice and covered If you notice on the mid section, um, since I layered my first color with teal, uh, you can see that it showed up in the mid section. So usually what happens is the first color you layer, it shows up very prominently in the cells. This is beautiful and it's a keeper, so I'm going to save it. Showed up in 
this is my second try and this time I am also including the Prussian blue from golden and that's what I'm starting with start with the darker color then I'll go for you know what no I'll go for the gold another dark color maybe another layer of gold going to be very interesting I hope interesting if you recall on this try I started with Prussian blue and that's what you can see what the camera doesn't pick up you can see it in person is like you can see each and every Prussian blue cell has a ring of gold and um, the little bit of bluish color which is really pretty so this is what I have, but it's too out there for me. I love the Prussian blue side but the bottom right corner is kind of like muddy I'm not very fond of it probably this is the Van Dyke brown portion so I'm going to redo it again I did my third try and I did not like it either so um, I did not record myself actually I did but I did not put it in this video because the video is going to be too long so this is my fourth try this time I'm starting with Nicolazzo gold then I added my ore from TLP and Next, I added the Van Dyke Brown from Amsterdam. After teal, I am again adding some ore and Nicolazzo Gold. 
and then I am starting to layer my cell activators. First I did my lamp black, then titanium white. At the end comes the gold cell activator. As I'm looking at the piece, I can see that it's going to be very pale once I spin it. So I'm thinking instead of spinning, why don't I do it one more time because I have all the paints mixed already. Trying to reuse my base coat. It's better that way because otherwise I'm going to throw these paints away which is not okay for the environment. This time I'm starting with Nickel Azo Gold. This color is con discontinued by Golden, but uh, they have also released another color named uh, Azo Gold. Mm, looks kind of similar but i have not used it yet hopefully they will be pretty close after that i used the ore from tlp and then i used the van dyke brown i have layered gold and van dyke brown a couple of times because for some reason the van dyke gold uh, brown is not showing in my previous pores so that's why i double dipped that and i finished the layering using the teal color on top of that i triple layered my three cell activators If you see that your cell activator is lumping up in the middle, just go ahead and give it a good puff or two. And you can see the result. They work like magic. As the cells are getting bigger, I am really happy that I used the teal on the top. As you can see that it kind of created that web-like behavior mixed it with the cell activators. As I'm spinning, I am uh, making sure I don't have too much paint on my um, tile. So what I'm doing is using a skewer and dip it at the center of the tile to see how thick of a layer of paint I have. If it's too much, I will spin more. If I think that no, I can stop, I will.
and I'm really loving the composition of this particular piece so it's a keeper I'm going to keep it let me show you how it looks